What? 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 Oh no! Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> the shadow of the ruin looms above, filling you with determination. Ren, I feel like I recognize this level creator. I feel like I've, um, remember this person from Mario Maker 1. Whee! All right, down the pit we go. It's always good when you butt slide into the pit. Music! Oh, what's it gonna play? Yeah, I love how complicated this setup is. Look at how complicated that shit is. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is Ruins from Undertale, right? Oh, I love this. I love when they have music puzzles. Yes. And now we solve a puzzle. Oh, can I pick these up? No. Huh. Oh, maybe if I'm heavier. Wait. How did I do that? If I stand on the side of it, I can pick that up. Oh. That's super cool. Uh, am I even heavier with this? Oops. Stop it! I don't know if I want to be in it or not. I don't even know what I'm trying to do here. <laughs> what, wait, what am I trying to do here? I guess I- oh, I, I ground pounded! I get it, I get it, I get it. Right, get this spring out of here, hold on. You go here. Go. <laughs> that was way harder than I needed to be. This is so cool. I love the looping music so much. Hmm. We could get through this if we could somehow. Do I need the spring, maybe? What do we do here? What do we do here? Let's go get the spring. I might need him. I also throw another dry bombs thing. Does this do anything for me? What am I doing right now? I'm not sure what I need to do here. Huh. So you can like, kind of go in there a little bit, but I don't know if that's, Helping. Oh! The claw releases that if I get over here. Is it gonna wrap back around? Come back, friend? Oh, now this... Oh! But that's cool. Oh, if it's holding the spring! If it's holding the spring? Or... I don't know, maybe. Then it won't hold. Oh no, maybe holding the shell? Oh, and now it goes through. That's cool. Oh, it gives me the. Sh that's really nice. It even gives me the shell back. Well, that's cute. Okay, I think I have to pound. I think I'm supposed to go in here and... Okay. Uh... Yeah! Wait, how do I get... Oh, I have to kill him! Oh, bye. Wait, was that a save or kill and I just killed? I didn't see anything to do! I'm sorry! Oh, there's more. Oh, is there a second one? I hope so. I want more. Give me more music. Give me more music. Yes. Whee! 
Oh, it's just gonna be the end, isn't it? Yeah. That was really cool though. Man, I could I could solve puzzles all day if people made sweet custom music to go along with them. I love the idea of how like in a one screen puzzle, you only need one screen for the puzzle anyway. So you can, you can basically use an entire level to set up music and then have a one screen puzzle. <laughs> Every one screen puzzle should start including music at the beginning. Okay, look at this thumbnail. This is called 3D Maze House. And this thumbnail is literally 3D, like one of those old, one of those old PC games or like shitty point and click or whatever, where right when 3D came out. If the whole level is stuff like this, I am so excited. Like how did they even, I guess it's slopes they, they, they use to like make perspective. I don't know. I'm really, really interested to check this level out. There's perspective. How do you do this? What is this level? My body is ready. Oh geez. Uh, okay. Is this supposed to be 3D-ish too, or not until we go inside? I'm trying to like look and see. I don't think, oh no it is. Oh geez, it's hard to see though. Whoa, it totally is supposed to be 3D-ish too. Yeah, whoa, it like took me a second for it to like pop into place. Whoa. We have stairs. What does that say? Oh geez, I don't know what that says. What does that say like 7F? I don't, I don't know if that actually says something. Come okay, slightly confuzzled. 1F. Oh, first floor. Oh, it's a map. Oh, it's a map at the bottom. Whoa. All right, let's go in the door. Oh shit. Oh. Oh, 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 wait, wait, go back, go back, go back. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> this is the pointing and the clicking. I have to choose where I go based on what I see in front of me in the map. And I think the red square is where I... Wait, where am I right now? Shit, wait, I thought it was the red square. Maybe not. <laughs> wait a minute, where am I right now? Hold on, let me just go in the door again and see where I come out now. No, it did, I went to the left. Oh my God, this is so cool. So I started out here and then I went like up and left. So I literally went up and left here. And now this is what it looks like. Look, we can like see around the corner here. Like this is the wall and we're like peering around the corner. This is so cool. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I guess, and this is just the first floor too. Holy shit, what is going on right now? This is amazing. Yeah, it's like doom. <laughs> okay, well I guess. Let's go, let's go up. What would up mean right here? Oh, it's the way I'm facing. Oh, I got confused. It's the way I was facing. So I was here and I went up, but it was like up to me cause I'm like facing that way. And so I went up this way. Whoa, okay, I think we hit a dead end. Okay, so if I go up here, it'll go up there, right? I think so. Whoa, okay, let's go up here and see what's in up here in this corner. What? <laughs> suddenly we're playing. Uh, suddenly, we're, suddenly we're in it. Jeez, I was that actually like legit about jump scared me. I was not expecting. I was like, my brain. You can't do that to my brain. <laughs> okay, cool. We're going back down. We're going back down. Oh, the arrow is telling you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I just, I'm so stupid. This makes so much sense. The arrow is telling you which way you're facing. Oh, okay, so we gotta go back. No, wait, is the arrow telling you which way you're facing? No, I don't think it is, right? I don't fucking know. Or maybe it is, because up here is up there. But why is, I don't know, where is down here again? Isn't it down here? No, I don't fucking get it. I don't get the arrows at all. <laughs> it is. Okay, it is telling you which way you're facing. Okay, if I am looking, well, okay, wait, we wanna go, if I go like left, is that where I came from? I can't even remember. How would I, will this make me go down this bottom path or will this make me go, yeah, it does make me go down the bottom path. Oh, that's really cool. What is this all about? Is this a clue of some sort? It's cause see, like I can't, I can't progress anymore through this area. How would I be able to? All right, keep my eye out for that maybe? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. So we wanna go back up through the pipe to go backwards. Wait, shit, that was the wrong way. No, I got confused. I wanna go down through the door. I wanna go down through the door. 
Where was that hidden block at? I don't remember where that hidden block was. Okay. Um, so if I go in this door, it should take me up. Wait, what? I'm just, I never do this right. Wait, wait, let me hold on. I need to freaking figure out the directions because I'm clearly still not understanding it. <laughs> I'm clearly still not understanding it. Hold on, this door was there. And then this one takes me down? I get a little confused about when I like kind of move over two blocks. I don't know. Arrow tells which way is up. Okay, I think I get it now, maybe. So if that's up, then this pipe would actually take me up. If up is up, then up takes me up. What? And now I'm on the second floor. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> oh my God. This is really cool though. Just in case anybody's not seeing it, like this is like, this is like a 3D image and like this is the wall like panning backwards. And like, you know, this is like the floor. Uh, and this is like, there's a little corner you can look around right here. It looks really cool when you like can see it. Yeah, I feel like we don't want to go to Chomp, but like at the same time, I'm curious. I just want to know if Up and Pipe will take me to Chomp. Will Up and Pipe take me to Friendly Ch Oh boy, oh no, I didn't want to go to Chomp. Okay. Yeah. Oh, well that's useful. I just murderize the Chomp. Just fucking murderize the chomp. And like, if you can't see it in this room, again, I'm, I know a lot of people can already see it, but like, just in case you can't, cause I know my face is kind of in the way too. It's like, this is the room that I'm in. And this is the floor of the room. These are the side walls of the room. And this is like the ceiling of the room. It's really neat how they set this up. This is so cool. Yeah, you can see it now. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Looks like old doom to me. I got a pow. I don't know if I'm gonna want this. I don't even know if I want to be on the second floor right now. I feel like maybe we should fully explore the uh, first floor, but whatever, let's go this other way. So this should take me to the right. Yeah, 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 it actually took me to the right. Okay, okay. Um, so facing right, down takes me backwards. So instead I wanna go left, which will take me up. That was, oh, there's the pipe there and I just went into it. <laughs> oh, do I wanna be here though? Do I wanna be here though? Was this the, this was the area with the hidden block. See, this is where the hidden block was, but what did the hidden block do for me? I just hit the hidden block. What? It, uh, oh, we're on the roof. That's so cute. Was there another hint somewhere? Shit, I can't remember. Oh, I did remember wrong. I thought it was this one, but it was this one. Okay, now we have a Yashi in 76 seconds and a dream. Let's go. We're navigating out of this sucker. Let's go, let's go. We went onto the roof and we got Yoshi. Back into the house we go. Uh, up is up. So I wanna go down to get back to the first floor potentially. Yeah, we're back on the first floor. All right, up is up, so we wanna go right. Uh, I don't know what's over here though. We're just gonna keep going right. No, wait, shit. Right was, uh, this is down. Yeah, this is down. Uh, down, this, I don't, my brain doesn't work anymore. We're going though, all right. We're fucking going. No! Ah! We have 60 seconds. Come back, Yashi. Come back to me. Gotta go back, gotta go back. I don't know if I want to get to that other area up there. There's like a room up by itself over there. Uh, shit, was it this one? This would go... Yeah, 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 basement? Do I have a key? I have the key! All right, we're going in the door. Oh God, we got a checkpoint. <laughs> All we got was a checkpoint. Well, I'll take it. I just... Whoa, this is crazy. All right, I was worried that I ate my ride for a second there. Oh, we're back in this like special room maybe? Hey, let's go. All right, wait, we got, we have a, oh, I can't, I want to go back in there to look at it closer. Did I just fucking wreck the boss fight? <laughs> Whoa. That level was like a mind fuck. I feel like I need to go through it like slower and look at some of the rooms at the end because I did that really fast. Cause the wiggler was supposed to be like going, oh, it's supposed to be going in and out of the foreground and the front. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, it's a room. Right, right, right. So you gotta, you gotta see this like, again, like this is the floor and the freaking wiggler is like away from you. And then he comes around and then he comes close to you. So he gets bigger. And they've got, they've rigged up this contraption so that 
every time the big one goes off, the little one then comes in, and now the little one is like, you know, crawling, the little one crawls up the wall, over the ceiling and out, and then that big one comes in the side. This is so cool. This is so clever. Yeah. This is... <laughs> 3D world ain't got nothing on this. <laughs> 3D world ain't got nothing on this. All right, do you like, oh, you climb outside the window, right? I think we're climbing out the window and then like climbing the vine to safety. I think I get it now. I think that was a window at the end. And the, the coolest thing about Mario Maker is just how many creative, like totally different things people could do with, with just Mario and blocks and enemies. This level better be noticed by Nintendo. Yeah, I'm, if I created Mario Maker and I saw somebody make this, I would just like feel like my purpose was complete. <laughs> and then they would, and then they would watch any of like my garbage levels, and then they would just like I don't know, roll over and just never want to look at Mario Maker ever again. The Cluttered Chaos Calculator 2 by Helga Van. The digital calculator adds and subtracts two numbers, but how does it work? Does it show you how it works? That'd actually be really cool. Man, the contraptions that people make in this game are so amazing. I'm always blown away. Let's see what we got. Wait, do I want to go in here? Uh, select two numbers between zero and nine. Okay. I also want to check what was in that vine up there, but we can do that on the way back, I guess. Whoa! Uh, how am I selecting a number exactly? Zero, one, two, three, four. All right, we're gonna select. How do I select it? Oh, six. Okay, I break it. Okay. So we're gonna do six. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, and nine because we're actually four years old. <laughs> wow, okay, so that's all you do is you break those two blocks. And now, um, nice. And now we math. Wait, what do we do? Oh, we can either, um, also, what's this? Hold on, what's the vine? What's the vine? Wait, what? Oh, I think it was telling me that I can select add or subtract. Okay, let's add them. What does this say? What is that? Uh, go in and do not move. Okay, all right, don't move. Oh my gosh, wait, does this show you how it works? Oh, this is awesome, it doesn't just do it, it actually takes you on a fucking magical journey to show you how it works. That is awesome. So, uh, shell hit an on and off switch and those other shells are fucking going on a magical journey. There's so many of them. And now this thing's gonna come and take me to the next part, maybe? Possibly? Or do I have to do something? No, 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 don't move. Okay. Oh. I'm guessing different shells come down there based on which paths are open. What is going on? <laughs> uh, oh, all right. Oh my God, dude. What is going on? <laughs> all right, I, I'm still gonna not move? Yeah, I'm still gonna not move. Okay, we're not done yet, we're not done. Holy crap. I'm just impressed that they made it so you can travel through this. <laughs> okay. I do this is crazy. I love how the claw kind of drags you. Whoa. There is so much shit happening. How long did it take to make this? <laughs> You can add and subtract any two numbers. This is outrageous. It's still going. It's still going. Yeah, we're gonna get 15 is the answer, presumably. Oh, yeah, I guess Mario going through this, oh geez, uh, is like making stuff spawn also. Well, the screen just like glitched out for a second there. How's it gonna tell me the answer also?
how in the world? Dude, that claw is glitchy as fuck. It's kind of interesting. Are you fucking kidding me? It's gonna blow. What? 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 Excuse me. Fucking excuse me. Holy shit. Holy fucking shit. I, I was like, wait, is it wrong? No, it's not. It's like 5 million IQ. What the hell was that? Yeah, what if you do a negative number? How did that work? Okay, there's all these cannons and I guess they will spit out bombs, which will, I guess they designed this so they can blow up to make any number. Oh, I don't think I was supposed to hit that. <laughs> I don't think I was supposed to hit that. Holy crap, holy crap. Yeah, let's do a negative one. What's in the vine? What's in this? Oh, does it just take me there faster? Oh, it just takes me to the end faster, right? Yeah, I think it just, okay, it just makes it go faster. I don't know, let's do six minus nine. Yeah, let's do six minus nine. Did I do the six first, probably? Six, nine, okay. Six minus nine, let's go. <laughs> now this happens again. I wonder if we're gonna basically like, as far as as far as the journey through the level goes, if it's gonna look essentially the same to me. Or can you like actually tell? Cause I think all that's different is like you're gonna get different amounts of shells. Oh geez. Okay, do you see all of these spots? Uh, all of these spots down here can kill these shells if the on and off switch hits at a certain time And I bet you the timing on that is somehow controlled by what you pick and then these but it's, it's much more complicated than that I'm sure but that has to be part of it Because then those shells go on a fucking magical journey And you would probably have different shells moving depending on which things you hit But then it still has to decide okay now we have to add it now we have to subtract it it has to work for every goddamn number. Combina it has to work for every combination. The, the way you face is different depending on the pipe you come out. Is that how it distinguishes between adding and subtracting is the way you face? That'd be crazy. What even happens differently depending on the way you're facing? I guess boos will fly at you or not. Yeah, there is the boo. So that boo might have been the thing that determines it. Oh, I see how it's gonna do the negative. <laughs> Yo, negative three! Oh my god, dude. <laughs> it's only add, it's only one of these seven. Yeah, dude, we just got negative three out of this! <laughs> That's amazing. We just got negative three. I just, I want to ask the person who made this how long it took to make this. <laughs> because I feel like they used like the entire level of just contraption. There's the idea if you want. That was cool. Anytime Wariozo makes a level, you just you just instantly know that it's gonna be good. Have you heard of the town in New Mexico called Carlsbad? I hate you. Alright, Carlsbad, watch this. We're gonna just we're gonna just absolutely smoke this level, alright? Just follow the coins, bounce on the spinies, easy game, easy life. Ugh. This level's really, really awesome. So it uses the fact that these spinies will like walk on stuff. Ugh. And you can like use all sorts of cool setups. Like the upside down one ways you can't interact with, but the spinies can still stay on them. And these uh, these little snake, snake is also friend. Snake can push, Ugh. snake can push spiny around. Create new platform. Car like. See, easy game, easy life. Easy game. Easy life. So there's a claw. There's a claw behind this. This is a weird setup. It's pretty cool. Whee! Uh, Alright. Swinging. I probably didn't need to swing that much, but that's okay. Oh, up here. Uh, around. And away! Yeah! Wariozo, like, Wariozo is the sort of level creator that just makes you feel bad about how many good ideas he comes up with. <laughs> Snake can, Snake can push, seems like this for some pretty sweet levels. Yes, I know, Snake can probably push 
Where am I going? Lots of things. Get out of there. Okay. Okay, so it, <laughs> this is so cool. So it hits the on and off switch and it changes the direction of the conveyors and that moves the spiny. So you get to do some timing with it. Really neat. We have timing. Oh, all right. Oh, this one's a little bit shorter. Oh yeah. Get in there. Easy every time. Okay, so now we have smaller spines. Hiya! Hiya! Nice. Oh, I barely got that. Uh, okay, so it pushes the spiny down. Oh, and then we can. Whoop. Bouncy, bouncy. Let's go. Um, oh yeah, this is such a neat setup. I love this so much. Also, you could be super evil with this, depending on how fast you make it switch. This is super sick. Yeah. Oh, geez, I just almost walked off the edge. Cool. Get me in there! We have, we have friends with us. Just going for a ride with our spiny friends. Oh, we have to get both of these red coins too. <laughs> uh, well, this looks a little hard. Oh, jeez, let's go. <laughs> I kind of I go when it's in. Yeah, all right, nice. Is this the end? Hey. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Really cool level. Uh, anyway, I, I haven't looked at any of this guy's stuff yet, but I wanna see what they do in Mario Maker 2. They've got a bunch of levels. Also, yeah, I got the fuck to sleep. Someone else is sneezing your sneeze? No, someone sneezed my sneeze. <laughs> I feel like the start of this level is gonna make no sense on YouTube. It's just gonna be me saying someone sneezed your sneeze. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> uh, okay, all right. Oh wow, we have a big, big train going here. <laughs> That is a lot of shells. Oh shit, we got a duck. Oh shit, we have fish. Oh shit, we have to- No, don't no, rotten mushroom. Oh wow. Oh wow, they like run funny on that too. That's interesting. <laughs> you can kick them around. Oh. You can kick them around on top of it. That's pretty funny. Uh, let's wait a second here. Yo, give me those coins. <laughs> it's cool how they break the bullets. Oh! This is fine. Hey, check one. Could you have really gotten here without that? Round two, fight. What? Oh, there's a setup. Oh, there's a setup going on off screen right now. That's why this took time. Oh, yeah, 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 I remember this. He did something like this in Mario Maker 1. Oh my God. All right, this is still sick and still works. That's really cool. This is awesome. So there must be tracks that are like dispensing all of these things. Shit! The momentum is a little bit weird. This setup is so cool. Look at that, the, the cannons are just infinitely spinning shells. That's amazing. It's weird that they don't like get in their way, get in each other's way at all. Oh! Oh, this one's gonna get bad for me real fast. <laughs> get me out of here! Get me out. I don't want to be here anymore. This music is epic, by the way. I love this music. This music's so good. I love how they've added so much new music to this. <laughs> Thank you. No. Cute level creator is cute. <laughs> so clever, so awesome. Man, I just want to like binge all of this level creator stuff right now. This would be so fun multiplayer. 
You're right, that would be so fun, multiplayer. Yo, there's the ID, y'all, check it out. Shell train extra? Wait a minute, 4% clear rate, hold on. Hold on, there's a round two. There's a round two, there's a round fucking two. Wait a minute, there's a round two and Ruby wants some too. Hold on. Choo choo! Oh. Shell train spin version. R, I believe that you mean Z, friend. Oh, is it the exact same level? No, it's not. It's not at all. <laughs> it's not at all the same level. Oh, yeah. uh, is that gonna kill my... Oh, it doesn't kill my dudes. Thought it might... Uh-oh. Thought it might kill my dudes. Through the center! I don't need your mushrooms here. Oh. Okay, we need the mushrooms. I take it back. Give me a mushroom. <laughs> I take it back! Give me a mushroom, please! Uh-oh. Everything's going according to plan. <laughs> yeah, dude, I missed the last jump. <laughs> Whoa, that's kind of satisfying watching them. Oh my god, my like the OCD of it not hit not hitting those three though is like get me out of here. Ah oh, shit, sorry guys. Wait a minute. Oh whoa, it alternates. It alternates. Whoa, that's so weird. That's so weird. Ugh. Do I want to hit that? Oh, I win the cracks. Slip through the cracks. Shit. Got to be careful to stay away when they like transition between them. Oh, there's. This is bad. <laughs> How am I? No, I'm not alive. I'm dead. We're going for the. We're going for the like 100% kill all moles percent right now. Doesn't count unless we kill all the moles. That fucking crack. Dude. Oh, the the fireballs are weird. Whoa. Oh, uh, we gotta kill him. We gotta kill him. There's only one way. We gotta kill him. Okay, that fireball is coming for me, though. Die, bitch. Okay. Yo, let's go. Oh, I really want to, like, try to get a helmet. I don't think I can get one, though. You are a super player. Yeah, I knew it. Super player. <laughs> oh, that has some W reference. Super player. Well, I think you're wrong, but at least... I'll take it though. Oh, that P-switch is what activates all that stuff at the end. That's cool. Yeah, it's like the harder version. Maybe just a different version. It's cool. Equally cool for sure. I like it. Super cool level. So how did it alternate between regular and spiny shamans? That is a good question. Oh, uh, we clearly need to try this level because it has 3,000 likes. Oh my gosh, this one just came out recently too. High speed swimming. What have you got for us? Japanese dude that makes really clever levels. Okay, this is the calm before the storm. Oh, we're swimming. <laughs> I love the starry background. Wow, this music. I haven't heard this before. Dun, 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 dun. Huh, interesting. All right, well, this is gonna get crazy apparently. Oh, this is just, this is just this. Okay, I mean, it's a good use for swimming. Definitely, it, I mean, it's just like, there's not very many good uses for this castle theme. This is like a underwater express. Okay, it probably has so many, um, it probably has so many upvotes just because it's easy. Dang. Still cool, but I want it faster. Yeah, this is like with wall jumps, I guess, but it's just swimming. Yeah, you could do this with, whoa, with wall jumps before. Whoa. Oh boy, okay. Harder than it, or easier than it looked. Die fishies. Okay, it was just like easy and cool. All right, all right. It was a neat setup. It's the only time I've ever actually played the castle theme night where it's like you swim because honestly nobody wants to swim. <laughs> nobody wants to swim. But yeah, I was hoping for a cooler contraption. I was hoping for a cooler contraption. A happy little platforming level. Uh, Bufflin is back. I don't know how to say his name. Bufflin is back and making levels. He made some really, really cool levels in Mario Maker 1. Um, if you want to just like get better at general platforming, 
I highly recommend getting this guy and just playing every single level he ever makes because he just always makes a super fun platforming levels. They're, all, they're always like, he's like 2% clear rate. It's like the sort of stuff that pretty much anybody can start with. But yeah, if you seriously, if you don't know Bufflin, check him out. Um, and then we're gonna do one more troll level after this. I just, I love how, okay, so yeah, this is a chomp theme level. I just love how Bufflin takes like one thing, oh, and just makes like a really fun level out of just one concept. In this case, chomps. Oh boy, gotta get that key. This is fine. This is fine. Okay, this is less fine. I think we're gonna do like the old jumperoo. Let's go. In there. Easy CP. Oh, this is maybe a mistake. Go. Uh, I like how it stops for you to like have some time to think because if I didn't have time to think right now, I would be boned. You have to. Oh, or I'm just gonna be boned anyway. You know that's fine. Highly recommend people like Carl Zimmer and Ed Young. They're both great science writers. Oh, get me out. Okay. Oh wait, I. Oh wait, no, I, my brain processed that this was a wall right here and I thought I was screwed. Okay, we gotta time this like a not idiot. Can we potentially do that? Maybe, possibly. No, we can't. <laughs> I like, I've really got more into math as I got older. I just, oh, didn't have a good experience. It's still go down. All right, go down the pipe. Hey, checkpoint. Okay, we got chompies and lava. Uh, oh god, oh, I have to go very far over there. I am boned. Very, very boned. Okay. No, I I should have jumped immediately from that platform instead of going down there. Are you gonna do a big leap? Holy shit. It, oh, they died. This is good. Oh, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, I love the back and forth. That was really cool. I just kept going back and forth and it just worked. All right, please mama, no spaghetti the ending. Oh, you can't, okay, good. <laughs> you can't spaghetti the ending. So yeah, super, super fun, super fun platforming levels. I'm, I wonder if Biffer's got any more. I don't actually know yet. I'm disappointed this isn't called Who Let the Dogs Out. I agree. Oh yeah, a dangerous stroll, just walk. <laughs> oh boy. Easy. Easy, easy. This is fine. Everything is fine. <laughs> this is cute. My favorite part of this level is that it's like a 10% clear rate. Oh, hi, friend. <laughs> Some cool setups here. This is crazy. Bye. How does he do it? Yeah, I'm, I'm a god, y'all. <laughs> that was really cute. That was really cute. That was cool. It almost looks like a mushroom. That almost looks like Toad's head. That like the where the lights were at the end there. Yeah, ten percent clear rate. <laughs> Wait, twenty percent. Okay, it's twenty percent. That's not that bad. Only one out of five attempts though. <laughs> Hopefully, it's like somebody trying to grind world record. Yeah, that level is really neat. A while back, I also played a 3D level where it was like, it was almost like a weird science experiment test chamber. Like there were four pipes and they all looked like they should be doing the same thing, but they weren't doing the same thing. Um, and it was really, really interesting. So the person, the level creator actually made a sequel with even more 3D trash. <laughs> a sequel to Jank, hint CP2, try to get the mushrooms stuck in the pipe by Tooth Mom. All right, we'll keep that in mind. Yeah, all right. Um... So this one like moves the, it moves the thing back and forth. What was different about that though? Oh, was I supposed to, wait, I don't know if I did that right. What was I supposed to see right there? Why am I, why does it say go left? What? I, I don't know what, well maybe we'll see something up here. I don't get what that's showing me. Oh. 
<laughs> what? So that one goes through the pipe, but none of the others did. What? It's so the, it's that one like that one piece of ground up there. <laughs> that is the cutest thing when it goes like wee. <laughs> you can go backwards. Wee. <laughs> All right, that's fun. Uh, going on a magical journey. Oh. Okay. Well, I think I have to get hit actually. Fobs don't take as much space as a block. Yeah, moon walling. <laughs> Oh boy, um... Oh, and that one works. That time the thwomp is moving to the right. This looks bad. I don't know what the... Oh, up plus Z. Uh... Wait. What? Which button Z? I don't know if I... I don't know what I was supposed to do, but it wasn't this. Oh, it actually doesn't... What? I don't know what I was supposed to do, but it... Or was I supposed to get hit? I don't actually know. I don't know what I'm doing. Bomb. So the bomb blew up those blocks. What is this gonna do? Up? What is it gonna do? What's going on? <laughs> oh. I hadn't blown up all those yet. I think I have to go back in the doors again? I think I have to go back in the doors again? What is the setup? <laughs> now it's... So the cannon pushed over the something something? Was the spring, was the spring there that whole time? Was the spring there that whole time? Oh, it hits you. It's just like not supposed to, cause you, I didn't realize you're supposed to be able to pass through this without getting hit. Huh. I don't know half of the things that are going on in this level. Um, is this gonna actually go through? It does go through. <laughs> I think I'm supposed to get that. Wait. Oh, I didn't respawn though. Uh oh. Is that bad? <laughs> Is that bad? <laughs> well, my power up's gone, so I wonder if that means I'm boned. Yep, I feel like that might mean I'm boned because I need to get through this. It's sad it doesn't respawn. Actually, why doesn't it? Um, why doesn't it respawn? That's weird. Unfortunately, I think I have to restart. That's unfortunate. Okay, let's actually chase this this time. Okay, wait, maybe it's some... What is supposed to, what am I doing? Oh, it actually reset this time though. Uh. If I, can I beat it? Yeah, I can, no! <laughs> oh my God, if it despawned again, I'm gonna rage. Let me just go through the door quickly. Jump, go. Are you coming? You better be coming, all right. Ugh, geez. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I'm good, checkpoint. Okay, sweet. Uh, whoa, what's going on here? There, the red blocks are pushing on the flamps. Down. What? What? Why did that make it get hit? <laughs> Why did that just get hit? It didn't make any sense. So it's like when I come at it, oh shit, when I come at it from the different angle, then it suddenly hits it. I think I want to get hit again so that I can, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> well, at least we just got the checkpoint. Eh. Eh. Crawling through. Uh... That one does work. What the fuck just happened? Uh... What? 
<laughs> Why? What? <laughs> what? Can I get that? <laughs> Can I get that? Oh, is this gonna let it out? Is this gonna let it out? Wait, can I get this? Oh! <laughs> Your game's broken! You can get it! <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, roll away to victory, let's go. <laughs> All right. Wait, what? Uh, <laughs> oh my gosh, why do these different things happen? This is so weird. Oh, go this way, please. Okay. So that guy doesn't interact with the bomb. Up, down. Oh, you can push the other thwamp up. And now it'll somehow, oh, it'll smash the, it just, that dude's forehead is just in the dirt. <laughs> All right. Seems legit. Checkpoint. What? All right. Mushroom, oh, mushroom got smooshed. Did I want to get the mushroom smooshed? <laughs> I love how they just boing, boing, boing. All right, we need to get that mushroom. We need to somehow get that mushroom. Let's uh, go ahead and reset. So somehow you can get this? What if I, what if I have that guy go up uh, while the mushroom is pushed over? I think that's the plan. All right, go up! Yeah. <laughs> okay, I don't know if that was the plan. That might not have been the plan. Where does, which way does this swamp go? Um. What, it actually comes out? It actually comes out. <laughs> All right. All right, wait. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, <laughs> okay. Get fucked. <laughs> All right. Okay. This is almost like, this would be a really funny troll setup. Is there something different about these? Those three are kind of the same, right? Okay, if that one just like worked, I would have lost my mind. Pretty sure those are the same setup. This is also the same setup, right? Uh, it's the cloud, it's the cloud. Look at this one. On this one, there's a cloud down there. And on this one, there's no cloud. Why having the cloud does that? <laughs> Hell if I know. Okay, yeah, see, no cloud on this one too. All right, no, so this one doesn't have cloud either. It like boops it. What the fuck, it boops it through. Wait, this one does have the cloud. Okay, it gets stuck. And this one has the cloud, so it gets stuck. Okay, okay. Makes sense to me. Uh, well, that's a little bit rude right there. Oh, actually, I need that. <laughs> I actually need that to go through here. Wait. Wait, I can't go through this! Janky Eggmate, indeed. How do I do this? I don't know how to do this. I'm holding down and it doesn't do anything. What else can I do? I mean, maybe I had to be big. Maybe I had to be big. Maybe I don't push down until I get on it. I, <laughs> I could try riding these dudes up hot. Put that one down and then up here. Oh. 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 Or I don't think it's possible. It's not possible. This makes no sense. I had to do it, all right? I had to do it. I had to fucking try. I had to try. Oh, shit. <laughs> I had to try. So it actually does work. It just doesn't work. <laughs> I was curious. Oh, that's actually bad. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's actually bad. There's no second one of those. Wait a minute. Oh, no. Is this a soft log? Okay, it's not a soft log. <laughs> Uh oh. <laughs> okay, let's just wait a second. What? <laughs> what? Excuse 
Excuse me, what the fuck was that? All right, we're just gonna like keep our cat suit <laughs> and get the fuck out of here. Ugh, ugh. Do I want to go in here? I don't know if I wanted to go left or if I wanted to go in there. Uh, <laughs> it just traded places. Wait, how do I? Uh oh. Oh, I can just get hit and then I can get it. Okay. Okay. For a second, I was wondering if I was gonna like get stuck up there, but I didn't. <laughs> All right. 3D world, still full of jank. The weirdest one to me is when there's a mushroom platform, you just can't go down a glass pipe. That just seems strange. Like it shouldn't be like that. If you want to climb in a Carl box of your own, my editor's girlfriend actually made a sick design for a t-shirt. Can be botanated as of right now. Think inside the car box. Oh my God, Ruby is like in my ear right now. <laughs> what are you doing in there? Is the t-shirt shipped in a box? It is. You really need to stream at better times. The fuck is your sleep schedule? Yeah, my sleep always gets up, gets messed up. It turns out I have um, I have a sleep disorder called uh, non twenty four like circadian disorder or something like that. Um, finally made a lot of sense when I looked up what that was. Holy shit! I guess this is why you shouldn't like stare at computer screens when you're growing up. <laughs> Basically, like every day. If I were to go to sleep, like let's say I go to sleep at 10 p.m. The next day, if I try to go to sleep at 10 p.m., I won't be able to. I'll, I won't be able to go to sleep until like 11 p.m. Um, and it basically just like cycles like that. Non 24 hour sleep wake cycle. Yeah, <laughs> you have no circadian rhythm. Well you do, it's just not 24 hours. Um, I realized that I've like pretty much had it. It's, I think since I was a teenager, currently go to bed at noon and get around 7 p.m. Rip, I have that same problem. Currently going to sleep at 9 a.m. Yeah, if left to my own devices, I will just like constantly go to bed. I'll go to bed at very, very random times. Like it keeps kind of cycling around. I probably have that. I can never get to bed. See, that's the thing is like if you, for me, it's like if I have to go to classes or, you know, go to meetings or whatever, then I'm basically just have to get up at a time that my body doesn't want to get up at. And I end up being sleep deprived. But if I'm left to my own devices, then I will just sleep like I'm, Totally, you know, I'll never, I'll always get eight hours of sleep every day, but it'll be like slowly shifted around the clock. I've read about ways to make it better. Like you could, so you can wear these, um, you can wear these like super blue light filtering glasses. Uh, apparently blue light triggers your brain to like be awake. The idea is like, normally the sun is out during the day and your body sort of like develops its day night cycle based on when it sees the sun. And I think artificial lights, especially computer screens, really fucked with that. I wear those just for fun. Yeah, they're pretty dope. Oh yeah. Uh, you have to take a sleep aid and melatonin. See, the thing is, is like, um, if I take melatonin, I feel like I get super groggy and I don't know, it just makes me kind of feel like crap. So I did not, did not do that. It just didn't seem like it worked very well for me. Um, but yeah, I also have this like, it's like sun simulator. It's called Happy Light. <laughs> and the idea is, is like when you wake up, you turn that on and it's like, hey, the sun, it's, it's, it is daytime out, you should be awake. And then, it, but then it's still like, um, it seemed like it worked a little bit, but like if I stop using it or don't use it long enough for like even one day, then it just like slowly drifts off. It made me groggy. Oh, that's what sleepy feels like. <laughs> I guess what I mean by that is, is it like, I slept, but I didn't feel like I got like restful sleep. I don't know. This is why I think there's life on other planets. Because this, right there, that little fucking thing is the Andromeda galaxy. And this is a blown up picture taken by the Hubble telescope of that galaxy. And then it fucking zooms in. The entire rest of this zooms in just on that one part of the Andromeda galaxy. 
and it is just like every single fucking spec on that thing, every single spec, <laughs> to do these close captioning though, music, is a star. Every single one of those damn dots is a star. They're all stars. All of them. All of them. And it zooms in more. And you realize every single fucking speck there is a damn star. Every fucking one of them. And as it gets closer to the center of the galaxy, there's more and more and more. And it gets so many, it's too fucking bright. It's too fucking bright. And all of that, all of that is that one galaxy up there in the sky. That one galaxy. Okay, pair that. Pair fucking that with this. This is the Hubble Deep Field. Okay, every fucking thing in this picture now is a galaxy with presumably similar numbers of stars as you just saw in Andromeda. Every single one of these is a fucking galaxy. Every single smudge, every single dot. And this Hubble Deep Field picture came from one, I think it's like 65 millionth of the sky. They zoomed in on one spot in the sky that was like 1 65 millionth of the whole thing. And that's how many galaxies you can fucking see it in. Imagine thinking that we're the only thing in that just giant fucking expanse. Like, there's that quote that's like, whether there is, whether we're alone in the universe or not, like both things are just absolutely like outrageous. <laughs> there's just so much stuff out there. One of those planets, there's a version of Carl that's actually good at Mario. Wow! Wow! <laughs> it's not that we won't find life, it's just the chance of finding it is basically infinity divided by infinity. Yeah, I'm I'm not like, I don't think we're going to find life in our lifetime. In our lifetime? That's weird to say. Like, I feel like if there are microbes on other planets in our solar system, then we probably then they're probably just the same shit that's growing on Earth because it like got contaminated from Earth. I don't really know though. I mean, I hope that's not the case, but would you willingly go to Mars permanently? Uh, probably not. I am, I am, all right, look. Look, in life, let me give you a life lesson, all right? <laughs> Everybody has strengths and weaknesses. Everybody's got their pluses and their minuses. Everybody has their place. I am not brave, all right? My place is not in doing brave things. <laughs> my place is sitting in a lab, working with harmless microbes, studying things and doing shit like that, all right? I am not the right person for the job. <laughs> X equals nine. Science Yoshi's racing the clock and it ain't no joke. Let's fucking go, 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 go. Yeah. Science Yoshi, what's the news? We are all made of star stuff. Some